history doesn't repeat itself. In the 1971 playoffs, Kansas City lost to Miami after kicker Jan Stenerud missed a, v a field goal. Tonight, it was uh, Nick Lowry who had the chance to kick the Dolphins right out of the playoffs. Ken Tomash was in Miami and has the story. While Dan Marino and the Dolphins were making their first trip to the playoffs in five years, the Chiefs were pinning their hopes for their first postseason victory in more than two decades on 36-year-old quarterback Steve DeBerg. And in the first half, DeBerg ran the KC offense to near perfection. With play-action passing, he led the Chiefs to a quick Nick Lowry field goal and a 3-0 lead. Miami's only points of the first half came off the foot of Pete Stojanovic. Look at this, a playoff record 58-yarder to open the second quarter. DeBerg kept the Dolphin defense off balance, capping this second period drive with a 26-yard TD throw to Stefan Page to make it 10-3 at the half. Miami was too busy making mistakes to threaten seriously. Kansas City capitalized on this fumble by Mark Duper and turned it into three more points from Lowry. KC led it 16-3, going into the final 15 minutes. Still, even while DeBerg was enjoying the lead, he felt uneasy that the Chiefs couldn't put the Dolphins away. I remember thinking, you know, we're letting these guys hang around too much, you know. And, um, you know, we had too many opportunities to kind of shut the door on them, and it didn't happen. Hey, it was either get it done or go home. And, uh, you know, we just, you know, we all got together in the home and said, hey, we got to get it done, and we did. And here's how they did it. After Lowry's third field goal, Marino led Miami on a 66-yard drive, capping it with a one-yard scoring toss to Page that made it 16-10. to and after the defense stopped DeBerg and the Chiefs again, Marino went to work again, mixing the run and the pass and finishing it with a 12-yarder to Mark Clayton that made it 17 to 16 with three and a half minutes left. But it wasn't over, not until Nick Lowry's last minute field goal try fell short. The final, Miami 17, Kansas City 16. We haven't been in the playoffs in so long and uh, everybody's excited about it. You know, the team showed a lot of character and, uh, and uh, Shows that we're capable of winning in tight ball games and guys staying together. So I think everybody's excited about it. Especially Don Shula. This win sure brightened the coach's 61st birthday. Are you all going to Buffalo? <laughs> <laughs> we're going there or somewhere, I guess. We're going to play again. But uh, what a great feeling. Yes, Don, the Dolphins will be going somewhere next week. They'll find out exactly where tomorrow. But it'll either be up to Buffalo or out to L.A. Both the Bills and Raiders have already beaten the Finns this year. In Miami, Ken Tomash, Wink Sports Tonight.